Yo, before we get into this video, I want to get into the sponsor of today's video, which is ExpressVPN. In case you have no clue what a VPN is, imagine if every network you connected to could see all the information on your phone, tablet, or computer. ExpressVPN creates their own secure tunnel that's like a barrier between your device and the internet. What this means is that your data will be protected from hackers, your internet service provider, and even websites that sometimes sell your private information. Me personally, I use a VPN on websites like Netflix that allow me to watch content like Spider-Man. ExpressVPN invests in only the premium server which makes them faster than any other VPN provider and on top has 24-7 customer support. To get ExpressVPN, there's going to be a link in the description and in the pinned comment so you can't miss it and when you use my link, you will get your first three months for free. If you're looking for a VPN, I can assure you ExpressVPN is the way to go and Let's get straight into this video. So before we even hop in game, I think the number one thing you could do is figure out if you have like a Logitech mouse or if you have a Razer mouse, go into like the Synapse or the G Hub. And what I want you to do is set your scroll wheel down to jump or technically spacebar because counter blocks doesn't have any like um, key binds or a way to remap it so what i usually do is i go right here scroll wheel down keyboard function click on this hit spacebar so it knows what the jump key is save it and now anytime i'm going to be hitting scroll wheel down this is going to be allowing me to b hop anytime i hit this it's just going to be way easier to just spam scroll wheel down multiple times to hit space and pretty much always have a consistent jump so as you can kind of see on the top right of the screen here, uh, I have a overlay set so you can see A, D, W, A, S, C, pretty much all my main keys. And right now I'm actually hitting scroll wheel down, and, but you don't see it because I have the Razer Synapse set up. So therefore it's like um, hitting space bar. So you're going to see every time I'm jumping it's saying space bar, but I can promise you I'm just hitting scroll wheel down. And honestly, this has worked perfectly for me if you really want to time hitting spacebar and all your jumps go for it it i guess it really doesn't matter as long as you're confident in your jumps or not but yeah to get started let's talk about air strafing so if i'm looking here and i want to be hop to the left instead of holding w and looking left you see how i just kept going in a straight line what you're gonna do is the second you are jumping in the air i want you to hit a as you look left so it should look like this see how it's like i guess like a curve to it and you can use like w and s if you want to go like sideways but that's really advanced but that's besides the point a to look left and when you're looking right use d so when you're jumping anytime you're looking left or right just remember to hit these keys and i hope the overlay kind of shows And if you really want to get fancy, you could use W and S. It really doesn't matter, but yeah, I mean, this is pretty much the essentials to be hopping. Air strafing. I'm sorry if I'm not the best at explaining it. It really is kind of complicated. At the same time, this is what separates like normal movement versus like somebody who's actually kind of good at the game and has played previously getting this down. But yeah, you can kind of see. Also, I did notice that they did kind of nerf b-hopping right away from launch if you remember you used to have like a little speed boost at the um start of every jump but i think it's just like valorant now in a way where it's like the same speed all throughout um just jumping it's just the same speed so it's kind of weird now but as you can see i'm also still not the best i am kind of rusty but i mean for the most part you can kind of see like where this would be used it feels nice to be hop i think it's probably one of the nicest and coolest features that they've added this cb probably should have been added years ago but hey we're still grateful that we have it man i mean you can literally see i'm not holding w at all it's literally just a and d Yeah, I'm also not the best. You can see I'm kind of hitting my head and losing my speed at some parts. And when you do that, you're pretty much just going to have to like restart, hold W for a second, get your speed back up, and then start jumping again. But yeah, B-hopping is definitely one of the coolest features I've seen added to this game. Let me know what you guys think about the current state of counter blocks. Um, 
I kind of want to veer off into more personal stuff because it has been a while since I've been uploading on the channel. Um, I am almost, almost done with college. I'm down to just one class, one whole class that I'm going to be taking over the summer. Um, after that, I should have my degree and I'm good to go. And I'm really sorry for just kind of taking a pause on everything. If you guys don't remember, I used to have countless issues, even live streaming with my stream crashing every two seconds or just being a problem. So I've, I've upgraded my PC. I got a i9 13900k a 4070ti new motherboard ddr5 ram i've got a new two terabyte as well i pretty much just upgraded my whole rig and then on top of that my upload speed got increased as well to about 130 which means hopefully 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 for the love of god please i hope i can stream again and i really do want to get back into streaming it's not like it's something that i pushed away it was more just an annoyance every time i went live it crash and then it led to audio issues where people couldn't even hear me it just was definitely not an enjoyable time for anyone watching nor me trying to figure out what is wrong with everything but i want to get back into the hang of things i want to get back into daily uploading i know this is kind of off topic but we did have a winner claim the butterfly knife cosmos and dropout glove giveaway he already got his prize and everything that's not a worry i do want to make more giveaways in the future now that i'm kind of getting back into hang of things so i guess leave a comment down below too what you think i should give away next i told you i would give away a butterfly twitch at 100k subs so when that comes say goodbye to my butterfly twitch that's going to some lucky viewers and so keep your eye out for that thank you so much again for everyone that still watches up to this point it really does mean the world to me make sure to click like and subscribe if you have not already uh stay safe do your homework don't drop out